So my people, I'm back again as this is a high school and I'm liking your response so far. So Marai, let's talk about what happened to my quarter high school. Normally kwa normal high school stima ikipotea especially kwa boys school wasa anapiga kelele mbaya mwingine kofi a lot of things happen right well but for me me it can happen more than that so ninja niko form 4 at this point and i'm a prefect wale makarao so stima ikapotea na nilikuwa on duty so as usual prefect on duty unafaa uende u keep peace. Kupunguza tisi za masuala sababu kuna watu walikuwa wanapigwa sima ikipata a lot of things used to happen. So sima ikipata a prefect will, will have to patrol around kama wasa wa nyumba 10 ni nini nini. So on this particular day ni preps kama saa tatu hivi and then steamer goes boop. <laughs> so on the game duty nikatoka hiyo time nilikuwa nikatoka class nikaenda form 2. Kambia watu na mazeni, you know, they all do kwenye karawa likuwa nakama, anafana. And then, out of nowhere, nasikia, mwa. How do you know? A nigga just comes from out of nowhere and kisses me. So, for a minute, for a minute, nigga, like, what the fuck just happened? Got it! And then, lucky, the steamer ikarudi chena, like, immediately after someone delivered that kiss, steamer ikarudi. At this point, I feel like the fan of Ambeni goes straight. <laughs> Some of you guys can start going, I mean, getting ahead of yourselves. So, Steve Akurudi, I see this dude, I'm a small Who are you? Basically, it's, it's, it's a form two. And you go to your class. You go to your room, 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 you go to your ninjas were LGBTQ, yeah, those guys. So, that thing was so weird. Marakwans are looking at this dude. I don't want to mention names because I'm going to go, Hey, I'm going to go to the gym and then I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to go straight. I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to go to the I see this dude. I'm going to go to the gym. I didn't know what to do. So I'm going to go I think they'll turn to the gym. I'm class. Now guys, I wonder if you have a story because eh, for me, I share a story because I don't know if you have a but then this shit happens in high school. Recently, I was watching watch content of my friend, then I was post something with some LGBTQ guy, I mean lady, and she was explaining how these things happen in high school. So basically, when you go to high school, Form 1 anakuanga assigned, whether by natural selection, ama nani, anakuanga assigned either Form 4 ama Form 3. The, like, when you kuranga na Form 4 anadala chini kwa dekaya chini then, Form 1 juu. So usually kuranga na some sort of relationship kwa inaanza kuhappen between the Form 1 and the Form 4. In normal cases, inakuanga tu sawa because this Form 4 kind of shows this Form 1 the way. Sindio? Like we go on a formal walk, it's like mtoto wako sasa at that point when I'm peleka, when I'm what what they're supposed to do, the culture, shule ni nini. But then once in a while, this form one anakwanga assigned to some guy man. Either you go straight, I'm a do a co fucked up than your kicho. This is the time when uh, when these people get initiated into behaviors that whether or not you are mahawaju because for a fourteen year old, marital sexuality is in that much developed in their brains, people are still confused. If you tell someone so many times you are a girl, they may actually believe it. I, need, I want you guys to share your own LGBTQ stories in the comment section because I think see me peke angry when I see what happen. Ama it's not me peke angry when I see high school by some other dude. I know, maninja wegina hapo hivu, either nindi umekizu wana umuengine, ama nindi ume... No. So leave a comment, tell us what happened in Kwashulelu, and then we'll talk from there in the next episode. Bye!